y'all. It's Nidian, and I'm back again. Um, this time, I'm going to bring you a little uh, character customization with Brink. Uh, I started a new character here, so we can just go from the beginning. Uh, what you do is you pick the arc, or you escape the arc, and I picked the escape the arc to look at some of them guys real quick. So first, you pick your arc type, and you go down through here, and you got different looks for your character. You cannot change this as far as I can tell. So what you pick in the beginning, with for as far as this goes, is what you're going to get. So you might want to uh, think about that. So first off, you got the look here, and then you got the geezer, old man, no teeth. It looks like you got the nose, makes sense. Big old schnozer, even though all of them have a big old schnoz. The chin makes sense, even though a lot of these are the same, just with a little rehashed here, as you'll see the sensei. Kind of like the geezer, a little Asian in him with no teeth, it looks like. Maybe maybe he's got teeth, I don't know. The smooth. Okay. I don't know. Doesn't make much sense to me. The bruiser. This is what my main character is, is the bruiser here. The cycle. You know, you got your uh, American pedophile. You know, typical white trash, looks like. You got the young. That uh, also makes no sense to me. The sour, a little old, a little pissed off and cranky. Kind of looks ex almost exactly like the sensei. The veteran, a little beat up, almost like the bruiser a little bit, or the chin. He took an ass whooping in Vietnam. And the suave, kind of a little Michael Vick, Kobe Bryant mix in, the, in there a little bit. So we'll pick, uh, we'll go with the cycle, what the hell. And then you can pick your skin color. White, white, or whiter, it looks like. Maybe a small tan. And then you pick your voice here. And then a uh, little crank, uh, that, you know, little wiry guy it sounds like. And then you go through, I don't know if you're going to be able to hear him on here um, very well. So you got a Russian guy, a guy that sounds a little French. Maybe you can uh, YouTube these guys and check out their voices. So we're just going to pick one and then... Your, yes. So you pick your character, and we're gonna customize. So you start out with head here, body tattoo. Now, when I go in here and pick my character, I have here. Is it in here? No. See, body tattoo is gone. So you're gonna want to make sure you pick your body tattoo that you want. So we'll go back in here and go through them again. So, uh, let's get rid of this. We'll go to nothing real quick. And we'll go to nothing on shirt. Alright, so we're going to do uh, our tattoo first. Pick your body tattoo. You got, you know, obviously nothing. And then you can go to your Yakuza tattoo. This one I like quite a bit. I wish you were able to change your body tattoos, but it is what it is. You got your... More of a religious type character same here as you can see Samoan this one I also like a lot really well done maybe some of these names ring a bell and in the comments you can uh, let me know what some of these mean crustacean I think this one's a little overdone but uh yeah wow Regimental, more of a military type, kind of look maybe like a, a mix of military and uh, you got the Brock Lesnar sword in the middle. More of a dark magic kind of guy. Biker flames, this one's also pretty cool. Borneo, I like this one a lot too. Your devil skull, for obvious reasons. And the sword victim, pretty much ha you just got hacked and slashed. So we'll pick, uh, we'll go up to the Samoan. Alright, let's start with head here. You got your hair, hair and headgear, face gear, tattoos and scars, facial hair and face paint. So we'll start with headgear. You got the dude, the G, the safety, face mask here. I'm waiting to unlock some of these. 
Uh, I have unlocked. If you're wondering, I'm up to level 10. Anything above level 10, that's I'm not sure when these unlock. So level 10 and up is what I have unlocked so far. Military, Vietnam helmet, dreads. Why is it in every game dreads look freaking horrible? Uh, the Mohawk, the Rasta. They just look like a big tat. Uh, man, they look. They just look bad in every single game I've ever played. Dreads look horrible for some reason. The spiky big hair. The spiky hair, just a little bit smaller in the front. Stripes. The receding. Buzz cut. More down here. The cornrows. Uh, the cropped. Military type haircut. Dreadlocks. See, now these don't look too bad. The fin. The tighten up. Another military. Not really, I guess. Uh, the tendril afro. <laughs> and the natural. Oh, looks, that's, looks like an afro to me. So we'll just go up. We'll pick one here. We'll just do uh, the mohawk for the hell of it. And then you can change, obviously, the color of all your hairstyles. We'll go with uh, orange. Now, face gear, you have obviously nothing. You have goggles. The hockey mask. Now, here's the interesting thing. This hockey mask here, the different colors are different designs. I'll go down through them for you. So each color, it's just not a color. It's a different design. Now, not, all, not everything is like this, as far as I can tell. All right, so we got, you know, each, each of their designs. We'll back out of that. The sweat. I kind of like this. I'm, I'm taking it that this probably has different designs too. The fire starter. Now I know this is just colored. Just different colors. Actually it's got a little bit of a design to it as well. Look at that. Didn't know that. So there's a lot of customization with this game. The anger. The fortress. The cannibal, the voice, and the dude. The voice is more looking like a doctor. So we'll just go up here. We'll pick the hockey mask. We'll change it to, we'll say that. Now, tattoos and scars. Actually, we're going to back out of the hockey mask, take that off. Tattoos and scars, you got a bunch of different things here. You can, you know, tattoo your guy up. kind of match your uh, match your tattoos from previous you can do this what I did you know you got your dead eye from a knife wound you got your scars down here some of them you can't really see too well there's your staples tribal eye tattoo ritual scars this one you can see very well on this face on the one I my current character I couldn't see him at all so I didn't even bother with it acid burn same thing stitched got what is that acne scars and your Glasgow smile which also depending on your face facial you may not see this uh, the other one I couldn't I couldn't tell these were even on there I couldn't even see it so we'll just go with a Mayan face tattoo what the hell face paint you know you got your skull your headshot clown voodoo face paint kind of brightens your eyes too or makes them white tribal and then your handprint so we'll go back up to nothing for here and facial hair you got a bunch of stuff here you got the disgrace like an old guy here real, real beardy and then you know the beardy isn't really even that beardy <laughs> and then you got uh, the beatnik just the little chops on the side there the chinny obviously just a little hair on the chin the chops, you got your mutton chops there, as you can see with a little mustache. The goatee, uh, goatee, the wrestler. The stubble, you might not see it very well, but you can see it kind of like a five o'clock shadow. The PI, the big magnum PI mustache. The trimmed, kind of like, you know, got your little 
sideburns just trimmed up down there, your little goatee, and the wolf. Big old hairy guy. So that's what you got there. We'll just go with the anything. And then you can obviously change it to whatever you want here too as well. That's it for your head. So jackets, you got the anger. Just a hoodie. I'm, I wonder if they're all just different colors or I have it locked. I can't really tell. The boiler suit in here too. You got your different color themes. The G. The dude. Straps. Straps is what you start out with. And then you got the fortress. The loss is what I'm waiting on. My big old pimp jacket. The voice. The warrior. The wasted. And the fire starter. So I'll go up and just do straps. And then again, you got your color variations. And then we go to uh, your shirt. Oops. Shirt, nothing nothing spectacular here. You got a tattered shirt, tattered vest, forearm bandages, uh, a vest, string vest. Kind of, that's kind of odd. And uh, a long sleeve shirt. Nothing spectacular there. And then you got your pants. We'll start out up here. The anger, the boiler suit. Fire starter. The G. Sweat. Now you can mix and match these, mix and match your colors all throughout the thing. It's a lot of customization. Make your character the way you want to do. Right now, for this video, I'm going to stick strictly with the, the re, La Resistance. And I'm going to do another video on the police side because there's a lot. Everything looks completely different, as you can see. So, and that's that. We'll pick uh, the G for now. And then, you obviously, here you got your different color variations of everything. And then that's what I said. You can pick a gun that mixes well with your uh, your outfit here, or you can just go with something completely different and and go that way. All oh, here in, in your body type. This you can switch at any type, any time. You got the heavy. And let me see. It doesn't tell you what you can do unless you lock it. I'll go. Oh, hold on a second. I'm going to back out real quick. Yes, I'll delete him later. We'll pick this guy. Customized character. See body type you can do, you can pick at any time here. Here's here's heavy. And uh, can use all weapons, takes more damage, however, moves slowest and can't climb tall obstacles. Medium can use all but heavy weapons, normal amount of damage, moves at average speed and climbs over tall obstacles. And light. Can't use heavy or medium, dies quickly than others, moves at very high speed and can wall jump to reach other areas. And I'm telling you right now. If somebody can master the light body type and learns how to jump over walls and become just an angry monkey is going to be devastating in a fight. Mark my words, somebody that can master is going to be the pivotal point of a battle. I'm telling you now, it's going to be they're going to be hard to control and hard to get a hold of. So, uh, yep, that's your character customization on the La Resistance side of things. I uh, hope you guys... This uh, was informative enough for you guys, you know. And uh, have a nice day. Take care. Rate, comment, subscribe, all that happy stuff. And uh, see you soon.